Growing up down in East Texas was really a blast, and Floyd and I enjoyed every minute of it, and there were a lot of things that we did that were uh, just just fun to do, and they wouldn't get you in much trouble, and sometimes even get you recognized by the older folks for your cleverness and your ingenuity. Uh, the possum has long had a place in the heritage of East Texans. Uh, possums uh, have a lot of use. They make a lot of good meals, made a lot of good meals down there. Um, if I lied to you and said I had never eaten a possum, I'd be lying. Uh, most of you city folks, you don't like possum and little things. You like big stuff like cows. Well, if a cow was the size of a possum and the possum was the size of a cow, you'd probably be fussing about how awful it was to eat beef while you munched on a piece of ground-up possum, which is the other white meat. Well, Floyd and I used to do a lot of possum hunting when we were little. Uh, we enjoyed it. Uh, matter of fact, uh, my old great-grandpa, the only thing I remember about great-grandpa Whiteside and meeting him was that he had one arm. He had lost an arm in a logging accident, and we went to see him, and he had a possum in a cage that he was fattening up for Thanksgiving, and all oh, he was excited about that possum. Uh, Floyd and I hunted many a possum in our life. We uh, enjoyed doing that. We'd take the hides and skin them out and then send them off to uh, be sold. Sometimes we'd do pretty good. Well, you know, the prices kind of went decline After a period of time, we sent some off, and they sent us a check back for just practically nothing. Well, Floyd was really ticked about it, and so was I. So what we decided that we would do is that we would, instead of selling the hides like that, we'd hunt them for the meat, and we'd sell the meat. Well, Floyd had a good old possum dog, and that mean you talk about a good one. We took that old dog out, and we hunted. Man, we had it all planned. We was going to sell the meat. Well, one day we was walking down by the highway, and Floyd burst out of the pine trees. There was a big 18-wheeler truck coming down that road, just barreling along. Floyd run right out in front of it, went to waving his hands, you know, and a holler, and then the truck slid to a stop. Man, that trailer went this way, and it went that way, and it went this way, and it went that way, and them brakes was grinding and smoke billowing up. Finally, it come to halt within about 20 feet of Floyd. That old driver got out, man, he was just shaking. He just knew he had killed a kid. He got out and he said, son, he said, what in the world is going on? Said, said, what's the emergency? And Floyd said, oh, there ain't an emergency. The old man said, well, you mean you ran out in front of my truck and stopped me and almost got killed and there wasn't an emergency? Floyd said, well, I just wanted to see if you wanted to buy a possum. That man looked at him. He said, you stopped my truck to see if I wanted to buy a possum? Floyd said, yeah, that's right. man got mad, and then he thought a minute. He said, well, son, he said, I do like possum. And since you got one for sale, he said, yeah. He said, I guess I'll buy it. Floyd said, well, we ain't caught him yet. said, uh, I just wanted to know if we did catch one, if you'd want to buy it. Mmm, mmm, Floyd, that is one fine-looking possum you got there. What's for supper?